Hello, in this short video, I would like to show you a new Canvas feature, how to share content with others uh, and with yourself via what's called a direct share. Suppose uh, I open up my Canvas here and, and I have, uh, I'm still working on this course here and I have you know, two other classes, for example, that I would like to duplicate content from one to the other. Maybe it's the same uh, class, different sections, or a common feature like start here, which you know uh, you want to have copy to all your classes that you're teaching. Instead of doing this over and over again, you can use the copy feature if you if you want to send stuff to yourself. Okay, the way that you do that is so this is the this is the source, and uh, I want to show you the destination uh, to show you how it'll show up. So this is the class that I wanted to copy to, IT340. As you can see here, I haven't even started this. This is an empty uh, class shell as it stands. So let's go back to my source <clears throat> and I go to the uh, three dots and I say copy to. This small window opens up and I can search by the class or scroll down. Uh, so IT340 is the destination or the target. I select the class and I just say copy. <clears throat> And I close it and I go to my other class right here and module section right there. So it wasn't there before and now I have it exactly like how the other, uh, my, my source was. Now, as you can tell, there are four items in here. Let me go back to my other class and I wanna show you what else you can copy. Suppose I wanna copy an assignment, okay? So I go to my assignment page here, and I have this specific assignment called Remind Sign Up Assignment, which I want to also copy to all my classes. So <clears throat> I just go here to the specific assignment that I want, the same thing, copy to, and then it'll ask me, okay, which course I wanted to copy to, I can do a search here, or I can just type in uh, to quicken the search, IT340, it asks me which module do I want to put it in. Remember the start here was a module that I copied, and within the module, I wanted to put it, let's say, at the top. Okay, and I do the copy, <clears throat> and I do the close, go to the other course, IT340, and you will see that <clears throat> I had the four items before, now I have the fifth item in here. So it's as easy as that, instead of having to redo it for every single course, a great feature. What if you wanted to send it to somebody else? You have a module, a common module that your entire department uses or another instructor is interested in a particular assignment that you have. It's the exact same thing, except instead of the copy to, you would do send to. Okay, when you click send to, a thing to notice, you cannot send this to yourself. For example, my name is Krish Mahadevan. If I search for my name, it won't show up. It says I'm fired or something. It doesn't even show up my name, but every other person on the universe will show up in here. For example, I wanted to send it to a user by name Whitney Boswell, okay? So right there, <clears throat> okay? So I can send it to her, add her name, maybe other instructors that I wanna send it to, and then I click the send button here. I'm not gonna do it here, but uh, the process is the same, okay? Click the send button, and what happens is Whitney, when she opens up Canvas in her profile page, there will be a notification that says I have, you know, she has shared content. When when she goes to the account page under shared content, it'll show all the content that has been shared with her from other instructors and so forth. And she can pick and choose which one she wants. She can import it. Uh, she can remove it. She can edit it. You know, whatever. Okay. So her copy is hers. It is not going to change the source from who um, sent it to her. Okay. It's a great feature, uh, so try it out and hope this video helped you in uh, doing that. Thank you.